Blue Sky Plan treatment plans are too large to send via email. In general, CT scans and other medical digital data is often too large to be sent in regular email. In addition, you need to make sure that it's sent in a HIPAA compliant manner. To deal with these issues, Blue Sky Bio has created BioBigBox.com. BioBigBox is a HIPAA compliant file transfer, email, and backup system. BioBigBox has tons of great features and functionality, but we're not going to get into that right now. What we are going to focus on is the integration between BioBigBox and the Blue Sky Plan software. The systems were integrated to make sending the Blue Sky Plan treatment plan as easy and as quick as possible. Before doing anything, what you want to do is register and create a BioBigBox account, which you're going to need also in the Blue Sky Plan software. Registration is super simple. You put in your email address twice, you uh, set a password and enter it twice, and you then have a BioBigBox account. Now from within Blue Sky Plan, there are currently two ways of sending your case and integrating with BioBigBox. The first way is the Upload to BioBigBox button, which allows you to either send your case to somebody else, or just keep it stored and backed up in your BioBigBox account, which is accessible from anywhere from any device. Once you click this button, you have a send form. Put in your email address as the sender. This should be the same email address that you use to create your BioBigBox account. Put in the email address of a recipient. Now this could be anybody with an email address. They don't yet need to have a BioBigBox account. They'll still be able to access and download the file that you're sending them. If you don't want to send the file to anybody and you just want to have it accessible from your BioBigBox account, then leave that field empty and it will go into your account and it won't be shared with anybody at this point of time. In the password field, enter your password for your BioBigBox account. The file name for the Blue Sky Plan file is pre-populated and a message is a message that you could type to the recipient that will be included with the case. When you press the OK button, you'll see a process bar appears on the bottom left and your case is being sent and transferred via BioBigBox. You could go ahead and continue using the Blue Sky Plan software while the transfer is happening. What you don't want to do is close Blue Sky Plan completely. If you do want to cancel the transfer for any reason, just press the red X. Once the transfer is complete, a message will come up on screen saying that the case has been uploaded and or shared successfully. The second way of sending a case from Blue Sky Plan via BioBigBox is built into the wizard. When you use the wizard to treatment plan your case and design your surgical guide, you go through the process that you're familiar with that's outlined on the right hand side, and towards the end, you hit a stage that's called Save Guide, Case, and Reports. As part of this stage, the BioBigBox transfer screen comes up very similar to the previous screen. You enter your email address and your password for BioBigBox. In the second section, we've included a drop-down list of laboratories that could help you with surgical guide fabrication. So if you're sending to one of these laboratories, you don't even need to know their email address. You could select the relevant laboratory and you could send it and the information, the email address is built into the system and the lab will receive it. In terms of what's being sent, you could choose either to send the exported surgical guide or you could choose to send the entire Blue Sky Plan file. So decide what you want to be sending and select the relevant radio button. The message field is pre-populated with some information that the lab would want to receive, such as your contact information, your email address. You should also include information regarding the surgical guide that you're going to be using the metal cylinders, and shipping information. So just go ahead and type that information into the message box as well. Once everything is complete, you press the send button or press don't send now to just cancel out of the screen. Once you press send, the transfer indicator will appear on the bottom left and your case will be sent to the lab. 
If you don't want to send it to a lab, but you'd rather just send it to somebody else with an email address, just click the button here. A new field for email shows up, and you could type in the email address of the person you want to send the file to. Again, they don't need to have a BioBigBox account at this time. They could still download and access the file that you are sending. Once the file is transferred, you will receive an email saying that the file has been transferred successfully, so you know for sure that the file has been sent. In addition, the recipient will receive an email allowing them to download the file or to view it online via the BioBigBox system. In addition, once the recipient downloads the file, you will receive another email confirming that the recipient has downloaded the file, so you're fully informed at every step of the process.